Working moms, it's tough, right? Stay at home moms, it's tough, right? My point is both scenarios are challenging for many different reasons. For some moms who make the choice to stay at home with their children, there is still a longing to use some pre-mom professional skills. So they do. I call these ladies mommypreneurs. In this month's Mommy's Time Out segment, I show you how in between naps, school drop-offs, and soccer, they're exercising their desire to do something for themselves while making money. A st it's going to lift a steamroller? It is going to lift. Oh my goodness, that's pretty silly. After Reuben was born, Tori Levine of Harrisburg opted to stay home with him. She loved it, yes. But she also craved adult interaction. So she took Reuben and then other babies to the bar. All right, what you're going to do now is you're just going to bend and lift the ballet bar. Okay, you're going to flex and you're going to circle around. Well, I had like this 4 a.m. idea of, oh my gosh, babies at the bar. Levine blended her ballet and fitness past with her desire to help other moms. Um, so I started teaching bar classes, um, and the only way I taught was with a four-month-old strapped on to me. <laughs> Levine's since written a program teaching other instructors about pre- and postnatal health and fitness. She has instructors in five states, plus online classes, and she still has time to play. Right there. After struggling to conceive James Maddox, Mechanicsburg's Taylor Bland and her husband decided she'd stay close. We've been so blessed to stay at home and be able to have days that we didn't know that we'd have. While pregnant, Taylor began using beauty counter skincare products. Now the former marketing pro is selling them. I think one of the challenges that we have as parents, whether you're working or staying at home, is taking time for yourself, even if it's just a short walk. And the good thing with being a, a beauty counter consultant is that you can do it on your own time. So you might have something scheduled for the day while some things come up. It's nothing to stress about. Whoa! <laughs> Kate McCord of Lemoyne always knew she wanted to be a mom and to stay at home. She does that, plus takes time for her. So when he takes a nap, I go to work, so to speak. She goes to work with the Cozy Cub, creating personalized products useful to other mama bears. That's, that's really what I like to do, is stuff that solves my needs, and I know that other moms have those same needs. Kate uses social media and Etsy to share her products and she shares this advice for other mommypreneurs. As a stay-at-home mom, my job is not to clean or cook. My job is to take care of my child. And then my job is to take care of me, because if I don't take care of me, then there's nothing left to, to do everything else. Um, so find your passion. Mine is crafting and creating. And make time to do it. Well, for moms looking to do that, as Kate said, finding their passion, making time to do it, perhaps mom Sarah 